Hello my lovelies and welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Megan for those of you that don't know me. I am a accountant by Monday to Friday but come Saturday Sunday I'm a YouTuber wannabe and after office hours I'm definitely an influencer want to be. So back at the start of the very crazy, very unreal, <laughs> like unimaginable pandemic I started recording Birchbox videos and I started in my uh, dining room with no ring light and today I have upgraded to my beautiful bedroom which is way more aesthetically pleasing than the dining room and my lovely other half bought me a ring light for my 22nd birthday so I now have a ring light. I'm feeling very professional <laughs> today anyway. So um, I did record, I did, um, I did an August box and then I sort of went on a hiatus with um, recording because I um, had a couple of issues with my phone. I've just recorded this makeup look by the way and my phone died halfway through, like told me I had no storage left. So um, it was all not going well but I've decided to record me opening my October birch box. I recorded my September birch box but like I said a couple of errors went wrong so it's like I've taken a hiatus from YouTube but I'm back and I'm feistier than ever and I'm ready to provide great content so yeah I'm just gonna go straight ahead with opening the birch box video and talking the usual crap that I talk to you guys so yeah I hope you enjoy thanks for watching let's go <laughs> So normally the birch box comes in a lovely little pink box but this month it has come in a much bigger box so that means it's got to mean more goodies or at least bigger goodies so I mean I know good things come in little packaging but sometimes big is always better so I'm going to start by opening this I have actually had a little sneak peek of what is in this month's birch box by sneak peek I mean I follow the birch box Instagram and when Instagram's algorithm is not messing up I see the stuff I want to see and I saw birch box and I saw that there's a tote bag in here which is all I know that's all a sneak peek I know and for those of you that know me, I love a tote bag. Like, I don't even use a handbag anymore. I use a scuba diving tote bag. Like, I've even got a tote bag here. Like, an Aldi one that has all my makeup in because I took my makeup to work yesterday. I've got a tote bag over there that says I love Edinburgh that's got sweeties in because um, everyone's got a secret sweetie stash, right? <laughs> so, yeah, I love a tote bag. By the way, don't ask me how I'm opening this box. This box is going straight into recycling. So... This is delivered by my lovely Hermes child, by the way. <laughs> I always feel like saying that. So this time, it is not a box. It is all the tote bag, which I absolutely am ready for. I was putting that on the floor anyway. So I'm loving this. Like, I feel like I've got, I keep recycling, like I recycled last month's box, but then I've kept the um, August box and I've kept one of the summer boxes and I've even kept the very first box. So, you know, it's about time I got something different because these boxes are just... It's getting too much, you know. So this month is self-love is the best kind of love. There you go. So there isn't a sneak preview to next month, which is fine. It's just saying give your friends 30% off their subscription and you'll get £10 to spend at the Birchbox shop. So I am obviously going to leave my refer link because I get £10 off, which I love. And you get a cheaper box. So yeah, and I think, yep, this save and says self-love is the best kind of love. This is so cute. This is my new handbag. Catch me at work on Monday with my new tote bag. So I do know that this is a little bit related to Breast Cancer Month, which is this month. So I'm wondering if there's going to be a little bit about awareness of self-love and checking yourself. Or if this is just it. <laughs> we'll see. So I'm going to dive right in because, oh, it's exciting. So gonna try to do it in the order as always we get this little manual description thingy that tells us so it says your october birch box is turned into a stylish tote bag decorated with a very important reminder that self-love is the best kind of love and yeah there you go <laughs> what's more october is breast cancer month and throughout the month we'll be sharing ways you can join us in champion early detection and supporting those undergoing cancer treatment if anybody is sort of worried about breast cancer or detecting breast cancer, definitely check out um, the Copperfield Instagram and um, the Keeper Breast website. They tell you there's details. There is a lot of information out there on how to check your breasts, how regularly to check. And this isn't just women. This is for men too. So, yeah, you're looking for lumps and abnormalities. 
but yeah it's definitely important guys you gotta look after yourself because nobody else is gonna look after you it's all about you doing you so yeah i'm gonna jump straight in to the first product of this is month's self-love box so the first product i am looking for is the kiss and smink the everything everything chulum so let's have a look this says say goodbye to fiddly makeup brushes and hello to effortlessly creamy color i found it so what is this this is a multi-purpose cream that can be used on cheeks lips and lids as well but i'm not being funny i love my dr paw i use my dr paw part all all the time on my lips i am not putting sticky stuff on my face right i'm just a bit funny like that i just love powders i'm not all about creams but apparently, if that's what you're into, then here you go. It's best applied with the fingers. You pat this pink shade in with golden shimmer onto the high points of your face for a no fuss flush of colour that flatters all complexions. This is Swedish makeup, by the way. So, as always, great thing about the Birch Box, you try and products you would never normally try. I would never normally look for Swedish brands, I'm not going to lie. So, this is the Kiss and Smink, the everything. Love the packaging. Like, I'm loving the minimalist. I love silver. I love grey, it's really great. So the colour is Chulum, I'm guessing. I wonder if that means anything in Sweden. If any of my followers are Swedish, please let me know. So doesn't have a smell. This is a full size product, so here you go. And this retails at £15. So, oh, actually, I take back my negative Nancy behaviour. This looks like it could be really nice. So I'm just going to, I have got a little bit of highlighter and a little bit of blush on, but I'm just going to apply this. So it's not as sticky as I was imagining. Like Dr. Pawpaw, not being funny, is very, very sticky. Oh, I love it. Oh, I feel like this could be a good little piece to put on, just like on a simple makeup look, because... Makes your cheeks look a bit flushed. Yeah, this is really nice. And I've barely even touched it. Let me see if I can show you. I don't know how well you can see that. But it's a nice a nice rosé. It's really nice. And you get quite a bit of product, to be fair. That's going to take a while to use. So, yeah. That is the Kiss and Smink full-size product worth £15 in this month's Birch Box. Well, I say a Birch Box. Should it be Birch Bag? I don't know. The next thing I'm looking for is the Balance Me Beauty Sleep Hydrolonic Mix, which is here. This is 99.9% .9 natural. It's vegan. We love. So I'm going to assume it's cruelty free. I think that's what it means. It's vegan. And um, I just know it's not animal derivatives, by the way. I'm not stupid. <laughs> so great skin starts with a great night's sleep. Amen. I literally have like eye masks hanging off my bed because... I'm all about my beauty sleep. Like I need my eight hours sleep every night and I do suffer with light leak and struggling to unwind. If anybody does struggle with stuff like that, by the way, I have two massive lavender uh, candles. I light a lavender candle. I have a Twinings Sleep Easy cup of tea, which has got lavender, apple and cinnamon and it's a gorgeous flavor. And about nine o'clock, I get into bed, do my word search, do my skincare routine, which is normally vitamin E cream, my eyebrow and eyelash castor oil. And then sit in bed, do my word search, phone down by beside me, like on silence. If anybody texts me past nine o'clock and thinks, why aren't you replying? I put my phone down on the floor because it's my alarm clock, so I need it in my room. But it's, it's very important to just turn off from the real world. And then my other half normally comes up after me and then I put my eye mask on and go to sleep. Easy as that. So some nights I do struggle to sleep and I use the Rescue Drops, which if anybody wants any more information, hit me up. Um, it's really good for anxiety. But moving on, this is packed with Hyaluronic... I don't know how to say this. Hyaluronic Acid, Chamomile, Lavender and CBD Oil and works to hydrate, plump and smooth your neck and chest and, full, and lull you into a peaceful, uninterrupted slumber. So, this is a little spray. It holds six... Yeah, it says this can hold up to six litres of water. It's moisture boosting magic. It retails at £20, which good sleep costs money apparently these days. I'm just going to give it a spray. oh that's really nice this is really nice i'm definitely going to try this straight away leaving that bad boy out it's got a nice lavender scent and it's supposed to promote good sleep so i'll be giving that a try so that's the balance me mist 
for sleep and that retails at £20. So the next thing I'm looking for is this Anisui makeup remover, purely for eyes, this is eye makeup remover, and it retails at £12. Bit disappointed the, the bottle isn't as fancy as the bottle on the uh, little manual that we get, but it's fine. It's cool. We'll work with it. So this is the second makeup remover I've received from Birchbox. And um, I like having one that's tailored just to eyes because I use Kat Von D's tattoo liner and I need something a bit more like rugged than what I'm using on my general face for removing my makeup. So I'm definitely excited to give this one a go. And this is infused with rose scent and double layered eye makeup remover that's where its description is anyway apparently it smoothly seeps away all trace of makeup without irritating the delicate skin around your eyes which is very very important nobody wants puffy red eyes it's got olive fruit oil and raspberry seed extract and it glides smoothly onto the skin and removes even waterproof mascara so i'm gonna guess it's gonna be a bit of an oily texture um, if you want to see the full list of ingredients, you have to go on the website, it says. It makes me a bit nervous because what the hell have they put in it, but it's fine. So says, shake the bottle well before use and pour onto a reusable compound and gently sweep away makeup. As always, I'm going to do the sniff test. It smells like rose and I'm not a massive fan of rose. <laughs> Obviously it's got rose in it. But it doesn't smell offensive, which is good. So yeah, I just love using things that smell nice. So I'm excited to use this. I've never heard of Anna Sweet either. Like if anybody has and wants to educate me, I'll take that. But yeah, that's the Anna Sweet Eye Makeup Remover. And that is the third product in our Birchbox tote bag. So the next and fourth product in the Birchbox tote bag is the Arganica Castor Oil Conditioner. Oh, I love castor oil. Oh, we get quite a bit of this as well. This at least do me three or four times. So this is for all hair types and it's certified, it's got certified organic oils, Aragon and Castor. So this retails at £9. This isn't the full product, by the way. And it's perfect for those who regularly dye, straighten or use harsh styling products. Now, I hate to break it to you, but I was not born with purple hair. And um, this side is bleached, so it's a lighter purple. And this side is not bleached, this is a dark purple. So uh, my hair goes through a lot, so I'll definitely be trying this. I use sheer moisture, but um, this castor oil, vitamin E and argan oil packed conditioner imbues hair with moisture whilst gently cleansing. And it's really, really important to get moisture into my locks. I've got thick, frizzy, curly hair and it gets dyed a lot. So I'm definitely going to be interested to try this product. I'm always about natural hair care. You want to make sure when you are washing your hair that you A, don't wash it too much. I wash my hair twice a week maximum, but mostly once a week. Depends if I've got an event. You've got to make your hair wash routine match your events, haven't you? But I make sure not to use um, conditioners and shampoos with parabens and sulfates. They're just a piece of plastic in your hair. That's how I imagine it. I like natural ingredients because the hair is natural. Like, it needs looking after naturally. So I'll definitely be giving this a go. It's liquid gold and is centuries old to native Moroccan secrets, supplying radiance and nourishment to the hair. So yeah, and I'd love, if this smells nice, it's a bonus because I love having lovely smelling hair. Yep, it smells divine. <laughs> definitely excited to use this. So this is the Argani Care Natural Hair Care Cast Oil Conditioner. Like I say, guys, definitely recommend. I did a little bit yesterday, well, I say yesterday, on Friday, so this is Saturday morning, the 10th of October. I don't know when I'll upload this, but yesterday I did a little hair care story because I washed my hair, and although I looked like Charles II, um, I felt like I had a good hair day, and I just showed you some of the products I use, and m most of them are sheer moisture products because they're all natural, and they're really good for thick hair. Um, it's got a lot of castor oil and coconut oil and stuff like that in, but... Um, they are quite pricey, so one of the cheap products I use is the Garnier Ultimate Blend. But this is all for another day. If anybody wants to know my hair care routine, hit me up. So the last product I've got is an exclusive that retails at £2. £2 product. And this is a Birchbox exclusive bergamot cream body cleanser, which soothes and cares for your skin whilst lifting away dirt and impurities. It's suitable for sensible skin. Sensible skin. Suitable for sensitive skin and the foaming cream formula leaves skin feeling clean and soft. Perfect for your morning shower ritual. Perfect. Have a shower every morning. So I'll definitely be trying this tomorrow morning. 
the back of the packaging has a very special description especially for birchbox subscribers so let's have analyze it well look I, I don't know why i love this font like it's just nice like it's it's like an upgraded comic sans and i hate comic sans so that's really saying something but this is the shower of love. Feel free to embrace your inner sea line while belting out a chorus or two. Empowers everyone washing with it to take control of their health by checking their bodies for lumps, bumps and growths that might not feel right. Family and friends unfortunate enough to have to listen to your singing might just want to invest in a set of earplugs. I love that. So we've got a little nice product for showering, promoting a good message. Oh. And it smells, I mean, I've just put some on my face, it's fine. It smells divine, excited to use this. And if it retails at two quid, that is sick, like, honestly. So you step into a warm shower and lather onto skin. And I'm going to assume it's cruelty-free because everything in the birch box tends to be cruelty-free. But yeah, <laughs> well, that was like, I hate this. Like, I always feel like I just rush through, but that is all my birch box products. Self-love is the best kind of love. So I'm just going to put my products away whilst I talk to you. So that was this month's Birch Box. If, as always, thank you for watching. If you liked this video, please like it on YouTube. Um, please subscribe if you want to see more. Look how cute this is. Like, I'm just going to show you. Just roll my skirt down. Look how cute. What a vibe. <laughs> um, if you liked this video, please like and subscribe. If you want to see anything from me, Send me a message, send me a DM, slide in. But yeah, thank you for watching and thank you for supporting me during my September hiatus with um, with YouTubing because this is quite difficult, you know, guys. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you enjoyed the new scenery. I'll definitely be putting something in this middle wall. Um, I ain't really got any money to give a prize away, but if anybody wants to guess what I'm putting up there, like it'll show how well you know me. I'll put a poll up on Instagram. I already know what I'm putting there, by the way. Um, I haven't told anybody, so I'm excited. <laughs> and it'll definitely be in my next video. So yeah, thank you for watching. Thumbs up, subscribe, drop me a comment, and I will see you at some point. So yeah, bye guys.